Hello neighbors, welcome back. I'm Steven with eTrailer.com. Today we're taking a look together at our Rhino Rack roof rack for your Thule and Yakima tracks. Now again, these are adjustable roof racks that are going to let you carry your gear onto your vehicle's Thule or Yakima roof rack tracks. You do get two heavy duty black square crossbars. You can use them to hold ladder racks, conduit cases, and other work accessories, that kind of stuff. Now the bars do mount to your roof rack legs that are included here into built-in channels on the bottom of the bars. I'll show you those here in a second. But they again are a nice lightweight extruded aluminum uh, construction, very high strength, very high durability, and they'll give you that maximum carry capability that's out there. Now they do have a built-in C channel on the top of the bar as well, which I'll again show you here in a minute. And that's gonna let you mount your Rhino Rack heavy duty accessories and carriers. And they also have nice rubber strips in the channels themselves to help you cushion the load. And they're gonna help provide slip resistance. Now you can cut those channels or those uh, rubber channels to uh, length if you need to. So that's an option as well. So I wanna try to show you a, a side view there. So that's the C channel. That's the rubber coming out there. And on the back side, again, that's the channel that everything's gonna be mounted into. And it's gonna be holding on to the inside ledges of those channels when it mounts. Now, all the plastic legs and hardware that comes with it, it's all made of a very nice, very heavy duty, uh, they call it like a glass nylon reinforced construction. And they've got built-in quick release trigger mechanisms. So it's a very nice little operation here. You simply insert your key, Take the cap off. Now you'll see these two rubber, or I'm sorry, plastic uh, levers here. If you watch out of the side here, there's gonna be two spring-loaded uh, sides here. Let me pull this out rather. So there's two spring-loaded levers here. And when you squeeze these together, that just simply pulls them in. Now you can push them in, push them down to lock them in an open position. And then your base this will mount onto uh, the Thule or Yakima track that's on your vehicle already. These simply go in here, you pop these guys back out, spring load it. Now this is locked together, it's not going nowhere. And it even pivots up to 33 degrees of adjustment. So I've got that as well mounted on one of these bars. That's that leg assembly. And again, it's got a nice 33 degrees of pivot so if you want to match up the contour of your roof, you can very simply do that. Now, if you took the cap off here, like I did on this other one, you kind of see there's a hole in the bottom there. There's a screw that goes in there and holds this to the bar. Well, whenever it's locked, you can't access that obviously for security, but when you can't access it, you could slide this leg the full length of the bar as needed. So that's going to help you fit the contour of your roof, match up your crossbar spread to the rails that are already up there. So again, this is a very nice feature, the fact that these are spring-loaded, you can lock them out, you take them off the base, when you're not using the bars, they come with plastic caps. Now you can cover the base on the top of your rack rails that are up there on the vehicle, and it gives you a very nice, sleek, low-profile look instead of having bars up there all the time. So again, overall, very, very impressed with this kit. I like how everything's spring-loaded and you can easily get it on and off of the vehicle as needed. Now again, you're gonna get, if you need Yakima rails, you're gonna get a kit that comes with it for Yakimas, and you're gonna get the adapters for Thule as well. You'll get both of those in the kit, but you're only gonna use the one that you need pertaining to your bars. You're gonna get two sets of this hardware here. Again, I've installed two legs on, so there's already you know, one for each leg I've already installed. And then you'll get this bag of spacers and stuff as well if you have Rhino Rack bars or rails already on the vehicle. So a very, very versatile uh, rack system here. I'm pretty impressed with it. Again, the lock's gonna let you cover and secure everything to the vehicle so no one can steal them. Again, everything's precision molded, the inserts, the cover bases, the legs, everything. That way it's a nice sleek look when you're not using it. Now these guys are rated to 220 pounds capacity. Now always make sure you're using your vehicle's maximum roof load capacity as well, meaning these are rated at 220. If your roof says it's only rated for 150, then you can't go over 150. You should be able to find that information in your vehicle owner's manual. If not, you can call the owner, the vehicle manufacturer and get that from them. Now these are again, 65 inches long. They are an inch and five eighth inches wide and one and seven eighth inches tall. Now the leg heights, when they're installed and everything, they are three inches tall. 
And the T-slot, the open on the top here where you can add your accessories, that's 13 16th of an inch wide. Now again, folks, this has a nice limited lifetime warranty. Again, Rhino Rack just makes very, very good products in my opinion. Very lightweight, but very, very strong and very well made. So again, the neat thing with this kit is you can take those legs off very, very quickly, have that factory roof line look again, and you don't have the bars up there all the time. Well, that's gonna do it for our look today at these Rhino Rack roof rack kit. For your Tule or Yakima tracks, I'm Steve with eTrailer.com. Thank you so much for your time. I hope this information has been helpful for you. Stay safe out there.